electric three-pointer. <gasps> wow, that's an old-fashioned pirate smackdown. Just like my favorite movie, Captain Johnny in the Depths of the Ocean. Stand aside, kids. Where'd he get that thing? <gasps> if there's one thing I can't stand, it's bullies. Drop your weapons. Thanks be to you, stranger. Sure, Mr. Captain Jason, the Argonaut. <gasps> Can the kids stay with you while I check on the time machine? Would you like that, Miss Polly dear? <whistles> Wonderful. Back in a minute. Psst. Boy, please help us. We're not pirates. We were on a scientific expedition. Seeking the butt kraken, a mysterious leviathan that lurks in these waters. Captain Jason thinks he can control the beast. By giving it a virgin sacrifice. One of you guys? Not after last night. <laughs> now we'll be after one of you. So tell me about your mom and dad. Are they what you might call intimate? Kid, you're killing me slowly. Get away from that clown, Polly. He's planning to make us a virgin sacrifice. That's a lie. The butt kraken only feeds on grown men. So who are you planning to sacrifice? I'm back. What did I miss? <laughs> oh. What? So the monster only wants to play with Daddy, right? That's right, Polly dear. <laughs> butt kraken! Behold the treat I brung ya. Hey, genius, if our dad's a virgin, then how come he's got two kids? What do you want me to do, kid? Spell it out for ya. <sighs> hey, kids, is your mommy home? <laughs> <laughs> Polly, I want you to know I forgive you for this. I love you, sweetie. Never forget that. If I was about to feed you to a sea monster, what would you do? Shoot you in the face, of course. Purr, why you Captain little... Jason, you're a total What is this mutiny? It's only been 20 minutes and... Oh, ah! No, wait, I've been with lots of women. Well, at least one woman. Come to think of it, she may have been a dude. Done, lass. Now Mr. Cousteau can continue to study aquatic life. Mr. Melville can write his whaling novel. And I can finish designing the world's first unsinkable ocean liner. I still don't get how Dad could be a virgin and have two kids. Because we Ambersons are masters of the impossible. Right, Daddy? That's right, sweetie. Now, what say we never mention this subject again? Yay! Yay! Yay!